not scheduled. Uh, previous video was going to be a commentary, but I had to edit the middle part out so I could throw up some proof to uh, help support this. Uh, last night I tapped Prestige, and today, the second map tonight, uh, the pro happens to be in there, and he bans me by assuming that I don't have a legit uh, account or a legit tent prestige, and then he lies to me. Here's me sending him my third message. The first two are very polite, respectful voice messages. Otherwise, he wouldn't have, you know, sent the nice message he did back uh, that you'll see later. But here I'm saying, you know, uh, hey, buddy, <laughs> you can see that I played seventh, eighth, ninth prestiges in my YouTube video channel. So why? You know, after me defending you on the YouTube video, whatever, that he had against him, why am I getting, you know, suspended when he assumes that I have a, you know, unlegit uh, temp prestige? Uh, and I only played with him for one minute. Didn't realize he was the pro until the match had already started. We joined a game that was after the, their, you know, minute-long inter intermission. The timer started. I realized he was the pro. And then 10 seconds after that, after 30 seconds into the first round of the CTF game, I was banned and disconnected. Um, what's funny is the three maps prior to that, uh, what happened is, are you going to see here, this is going to be me si trying to sign in with Extra Guards X and showing that I was banned until the 15th. Also, take notice of the time. It's about 8.15. Uh, this happened about 8.5 to 8.10 tonight, Pacific time. What happened is um, three of us, Untouchable with two E's and NVGA uh, Outcast and myself were trying to play some CTF, even though the three other people were horrible, 110, 114, and then I forget what the other kills, guys killed death was. We still won 2-0. to zero. Uh, Two of the people we had played against were Metalocalypse420 uh, with a O instead of a 0, and Z, Steve Gunner's uh, Z. You'll, take, you'll notice why I mentioned that now, too. Uh, at the beginning of the match, they went and said something to me. Um, again, here I'm showing, you know, he didn't reply. Uh, at the beginning of the first map we played, uh, the three of us versus their party, there was no, uh, they, I mean, they, they sarcastically made a remark about my 10th prestige. Um, and that was it. We left to, to go pick up two other people, uh, Strong Machine and Optic Isis. She's a member of Team Optic and Strong Machine, her husband. As you'll see here, uh, I get a message. That's I, I leave this part in here. I can't hear him over the Modern Warfare music. Uh, I leave this part in here, though, because you'll see that I recorded without knowing what it even said yet. It shows number one there. I have no idea what it says. But, um, yeah, so what I'm pretty much guessing, since I went and checked the friends list of those two guys, the only two that had their friends list public, my recent players, they're both friends of the pro. So when we get... Back in the pre match you know, in the in the matchmaking for CTF, and we get joined up with the same people, except this time the pros in there. Uh, what I'm guessing is that they had mentioned, "Hey, we just played with this tenth prestige guy," and because when we came in, what what do you hear when I go in the first right before the map starts? Oh, regards, regards, you know, he he remembered me from the map prior. But um. So I da go to the dashboard where there's no music playing in the background, and here I'll increase the volume on my uh, video software. Now, here's the words of the infamous The Pro. I didn't suspend you, but I did look at your account and remove a suspension that was in there. Uh, you're in my Air Force. Uh, well, that's good. I'm a major Marine. Hope everything's going okay with you down there in McCord or wherever you are. I didn't suspend you, but I did look at your account and remove a suspension that was in there. Uh, you're in my Air Force. Uh, well, that's good. I'm a major Marine. Hope everything's going okay with you down there in McCord or wherever you are. I didn't suspend you. All right. I temp prestige last night. As you'll see later in my bio, I put the date in there. I had question marks in the place of where I put the date and how many days it took me. Uh, just like I have for the temp prestige, uh, seven or er, rank 70s temp prestige spot uh, until I, you know, I got it last night. But I didn't suspend you. It makes no sense, seeing as I wasn't suspended until I played with you. So either it was you or somebody else in the party. But um, yeah, but I did look at your account and remove the suspension that wasn't there. Well, first off, I mean, if it wasn't you and it was somebody else in your party because I just played with you, then why didn't they suspend me when I just played with them the map prior? 
If I go look at your account and remove the suspension that wasn't there, if I was suspended prior and I just played with you, what was the suspension for and why did you remove it? You know, that makes no sense. Um, pretty much I'm catching him in a lie here. He sounds very much like he's just trying to cover his ass, that he didn't do it when it's very obvious he did. And, you know, he removed the suspension that wasn't there. Why? Well, because I'm in the Air Force, you know? And he's a major in the Marines. A definite reason to take off suspension that I supposedly deserve. You know? Um, crazy stuff. I took some leave this week, five days, and oddly enough, this is my last day before I go back to work. What a way to end my vacation. Thank you very much, sir. Well, if you're in my Air Force, oh, well, that's good. Um, at first, I thought he said, well, I'm glad you're in the Marine. Or, I'm glad you're a Marine. But uh, now that I can hear on my computer speakers, it definitely says, you know, I'm a major in the Marines, and, uh, you know, I totally respect, you know, those of authority. I can't take him just on his word over the internet. I've had a person tell me he's a lieutenant colonel over Xbox Live and expected me to treat him with respect over it when after he trash talks me. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to do that without proof. Um, just not going to take his word for it. But, um, yeah, uh, I love Microsoft. I love everything you do, a major's minute. You know, everything about it. Uh, totally, I got I got a PlayStation Three because I won a whole bunch of poker tournaments over Thanksgiving, and it sat in my drawer so long I got rid of it. Um, I have a Zune HD. It's you know I love the software that it comes with. Um, yeah. So hope everything's going well with you there, McCord, wherever you are. Uh, again, the way he sounds nervous and whatnot just sounds like another way to try and get on my good side and uh, a very empty well wish. Here you can see the party I threw together. Because I signed out of Tunica Molesta and went back to Extra Guards X after I was able to sign in, I didn't realize that it wouldn't put the voice through the speakers so I could record what their responses were, even though it wasn't going to record what I was saying when I told them what happened. Because I knew they'd all love to hear about it because everybody's heard of the pro. The, um, here you see, though, I'm going and showing, you know, he's in my recent players. He's right there on the bottom, seen an hour ago. It, at the beginning of the video, you see that it was 8.15. Here on the time says 9:10, so one hour ago. I think it's 9:10, 9:16. Again, this is the preview part of my uh, Pinnacle Studio Ultimate editing software, so I can't tell from here. When I watch the final thing, it will show. But here again, I'm gonna actually because I went and checked those recent players' friend list. The only people I had on public were again Metalocalypse and uh, Steve Gunner, two people I had just played with prior before the pro uh, joined their party, and. Uh, both which have the pro on their friends list. Both of which were people that were uh, mocking me for my rank 20, 21, uh, 10th prestige, and then you know bringing it back up once uh, we got matched up with them again. You know, again, like I love Microsoft and everything else, but I'm pretty sure that assuming that someone cheated and then acting on it, uh, and then lying, none of that stuff is part of protocol. I, you know, Microsoft claimed that he followed protocol prior. But, uh, again, there, there you go. You see the, he's in the Metalocalypses, and then check Steve Gunner's friends. He's in there, too. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure that assuming and then lying to the user after he does the suspension is not part of their protocol. You know, uh, again, I don't hold Microsoft responsible. I hold the pro responsible. Uh, everybody is, you know, their own actions, everything else. I follow, you know, cheaters and stuff in free-for-all games and make sure they don't boost by ruining their boosting matches or their attempts at boosting. But here's the funny part. Now check out my bio, which this has always been my bio. Uh, the question marks also filled in the 10th prestige part up until last night. I put in the days, hours, minutes, and then the date. <laughs> See how pissed off I am right there? Grr. Bill, got pills here. Crazy stuff, right? Well, this is a video to show that the pro actually isn't as legit as everybody thinks. It wasn't just editing. He is just another human being that made a mistake and then tried covering his ass with a lie. So thanks for watching. Uh, this is Extra Guard X. Out.